rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Love you. I, I think that we missed, because uh, speaking of the kingdom, um, over over in Matthew, I think it's the sixth chapter, where it talks about seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. Amen. And then the Bible goes on to say that, and all these things, well, Amen. those things he had just been talking about was houses and land yes. and clothes and all that kind of stuff. So I think when we become to maturity, that those are not the things, in other words, we don't chase those things. It, it chases those. They become, a, they, the, the vortex changes, it changes. Yes. It's for us good. going after those things to those things coming after us. Yes. And that's the difference. But our focus, which we have not taught, we've taught the things. And he said, that's what the heathens do. Yes. And so we've behaved just like the heathens because that's what we've trumpeted and that's what we've highlighted. When what he said was, don't highlight those things, don't trumpet those things, you trumpet the kingdom of God and oh, his right. righteousness. And in those things, well, that's just like you said earlier, a byproduct. That's going to come with it. But yeah. that's not what our focus is. But that is a part of the benefits package. Don't get me wrong. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yes. My, I, 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 a testimony. When my wife was on the planet, 24-7 of my time was spent focusing on her well-being, her care. She was ill. So I never thought about how my own health very much while she was on the planet. And I didn't have nearly the problems I have now. <laughs> when yeah. she left is when I started manifesting illness. Oh. I mean, it's, it's like all of a sudden she leaves the planet and I don't have anybody to focus on healing or trying to keep well, and my health falls apart. So wow. there's, just, there's something, and I mean, that's, that's a fight. I went wow. from walking five miles a day to congestive heart failure, that's like, I started to cascade as far as my health was concerned. Just wow. you know, worse and worse. But as long as she was on the planet, none of that was the issue. I didn't have time to think about being sick. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because I was too busy doing that. And it seems as though that's the process. Is this selflessness, this selflessness, this self-sacrifice appears to be the standard that has been set for us. Yeah. And regardless of who the person is, Regardless of the state of that person, whether it be saint or sinner, friend or enemy, our behavior has been dictated to us to pour out yourself on their behalf. Yeah. Is, is that is that accurate or is that my mis 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 well, I think, think so, Truman. That what you generally talk about. The fact is that you know even in this politics, uh, I was listening to one of the uh, articles or commercials. Uh, with, uh, I think the lady named is Lawfer, the, the, the lady that's running against Warnack. And one of the things that, that caught my attention was pursuit of the American dream. Did, did you, do you ever heard that word before, Jimmy? The, 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 the American dream. Of course. That's and, why every nation on earth wants to get to America. Because we've talked this American dream all over the world. Everybody wants to get to the big PX in the sky. See? The American dream, it, it, that's almost like saying the American vision, right? Of, of, of capitalism or whatever, but it's saying the American dream is to be a millionaire or a billionaire. And, and yet that percentage is 1% of the world, or even in this country, is less than a 1%, right? And yet they call that the American dream. If everybody's trying to get into that as the American dream, opposed to what Christ is saying. Whoa. Well, come in with a bang, brother. Come in with a bang, brother. Hallelujah. <laughs> I think I think that's where we meet I think Elder, I think that's where that conversation of ministering people is we're not focusing on this the material dreams of wealth dream we focus on the right standing with god it, and man it, 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 surprisingly enough that has been the most encouraging thing that i've experienced in the last few years <laughs> and that's why i believe that the united states of america i feel confident about i feel good about where we're headed as a nation even. 
because the United States is, is up to this point functioning cardinally, as we all did when we came into the faith initially. And like any the growth of any man, this country is growing as a nation. And I yeah. think we're moving into the spirituality portion of it. It was a very selfish dream. It was a self-centered and self-edifying and self-uplifting and self-promoting kind of a situation that we, and we have seen the manifestation of that. And this is not a shot at anybody, mm. but this is just a reality. The, 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 the politic of our nation gives us example of men who exalt themselves above their constituents, their wow. constituents and use them to elevate themselves. Wow. That ain't God. And no nation has survived that. Every nation, that's why no nation survives, because when you use your power to subdue and to press people down, when someone rises up stronger than you, they're going to overthrow you. Wow. We are moving into a place now. I think we really are. And the church is going to take the lead in this, where we are using our power, our influence, our wealth, our resources to, and they call it socialism. That's unfortunate. I hate that, that they, they, they make this such a bad, bad, but the United States of America as a nation has to shift from hoarding wealth and stuff to disseminating it equitably among the populace. <laughs> that is where we're headed as a nation. And that is, that is done by love. The very